All right, thanks for tuning in. Um, today's video is one of those days where the fish just kept getting bigger. Make sure you watch this one till the end. Um, my biggest fish was the last fish I caught and the, the summer fishing just keeps getting better. I mean, you only need one lure and one rod. Um, I usually take about a dozen and I end up using the same rod all day long. Um, but make sure you watch it till the end. I, I, I catch some good ones. Stay tuned. All right, thanks for tuning in. I know it's a little dark. We got some overcast, gonna keep it darker longer than normal. I may have to re I may have to refilm the intro here. It might be too dark, but we have rain coming in. Uh, so I'm not going to have all that long to fish. I don't know how much time I have. So I'm staying close to the boat ramp just in case. You know, I'm in a metal boat holding a graphite rod. If there's lightning around, it's not the best decision to be out fishing. So far, no lightning though. Stay tuned. So I'm starting out on a little, it's kind of a shallow flat, but I've caught plenty of fish here. Just experimenting. With all of the, uh, it's been raining the last few days. With all the unsettled weather, I'm not sure what it's going to do to the fishing. Generally doesn't help it. There he is. Uh oh. Kind of acts like a largemouth. He just barely, just, just barely slurped it. Nope, it's a spot. And it's not a bad fish. Pliers. It's dark enough, I can't hardly, my hooks are caught in my net. There we go, I couldn't hardly, couldn't hardly see the hooks to get him unhooked. There we go. First fish, nice spot. Pound and a half -er or so. Just barely slurped it down. I wasn't sure it was a fish to begin with. Thought maybe I'd ran into a stick or something. That's a good sign. Man, is it humid out here. Ooh, it is humid. Hard to breathe. He did it again. Got him. I don't know if it's the same fish. I don't think it is. But again, just barely slurped it. It's about the same size as the first. This one's a little smaller. I 
All right, all right, that right there is why I come out early. Got a couple in the boat already. Turn my... There just might be another. That fish ate it. I mean, he took it deep. out of the water yeah he's a feisty one <laughs> uh, it never gets old A lot. That's a better fish there. That's a solid pound and a half. I don't think he's two, but he's pound and a half. Probably the biggest fish of the day so far. Make sure I don't have anything on my lens. Okay. <laughs> you know, when you have a pattern that's working, you just you just keep keep using it. This. Not all topwater lures are created equal. Uh, this uh, EPOP is... Oh boy. I have to retie. Always check your line. That, my line, something really had my line scuffed up. So I just retied. Up ahead of me here, I just heard some, a fish busting something on the surface. You know, I've been wanting to try this. Start at this, oop, there he was again. Did he get it? He didn't get it, boy, he came out of the water. I've been wanting to fish this area <clears throat> early. And it looks like I, Looks like I was right. Man, I'm going to run into a big one is what I'm thinking. Or I'm hoping, anyway. The hard part about fishing this early is seeing the dock cables. I know they're there. I just don't, can't really see them. Boy, I got a two hours of sleep and I'm I'm feeling it. Oh, he just slurped it. Oh, it's a good one too. large mouth you know I've noticed lately especially when a large mouth hits it they just barely slurp it in they're not they're not really busting it like a spot does <laughs> man I'm glad I I would just about didn't come because of the rain I mean, it's another pound and a half or man, that, that might be approaching two pounds <clears throat> I'm glad I came. A lot of times those large mouths will just come up <clears throat> behind it and just barely grab that back hook. If you've been paying attention, <clears throat> I never turn my electronics on first thing in the morning. It's been quiet all night. The last thing you want to do is have your fish finder pinging, you know. It makes a clicking noise. <clears throat> To me, that's just something I do. 
it just alerts them that, that you're there. Got, got two dot cables crisscrossing each other. Oh, there he is. This, oh, you know what? <laughs> Mr. Bluegill. And he probably hit it as good as any fish I've caught today. Look at the orange on the tips of his tail and on his dorsal fin. Beautiful. Just those five or six fish there, it's worth, it's worth me missing the sleep. I'll go home before it starts raining and get a couple hours in and then I gotta go to work tonight. Then I actually get a day off, which is nice. But it's supposed to rain all weekend. It's actually supposed to rain for the next 10 days. Oh, there's another one. Ooh, that was a nice fish there. There, I got him. He came back and got it. Ooh, yes. <laughs> how, how do you beat it? Ooh, it's another, it's another nice spot. Nice one. Boy, he wanted it, that fish. <laughs> oh man, I'm telling you. It is so much fun. Look at the belly on that guy. He's not that long, but that's he's probably two pounds. Just just fat. Nice. There just might be another. I can already tell this is gonna be a good topwater day. It, it pays at times to fish areas you don't normally, I mean, I've fished this during the day before, but this is normally not something I would topwater. Learn something every time I come out. No, I haven't caught any giants yet, but those, you know, I've caught some decent fish. <clears throat> and every topwater fish is fun. Boy, that fish just <laughs> hammered it. He ate it. I'm busy looking for the fox. There you go. <laughs> That's a bigger, bigger fish. Another pound and a halfer. <clears throat> I am not complaining though, huh? I like catching fish. Yeah. Another fat little pound and a halfer, pound and a quarter maybe. Jeez, he 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 really slammed it. <laughs> I'm busy looking for that fox again. Need to pay attention to what I'm doing. I'm glad I fished that area. At least I know that there are some fish here early. This time of year though, once the sun gets up, it's tough. Tough fishing. Right up there. Oh, there was one chasing it right here at the boat. I, I re reeled up too fast. Man, I just, up here on the point, I just saw fish feeding. They're eating today. <laughs> I don't, I hope you heard that. 
Boy, they're all about pound and a quarter, pound and a half. This one might be a little smaller than that even. That's okay. I like catching fish. I, it, they don't all have to be big. <laughs> yeah, this one's, he's just a dinker, but that's all right. <laughs> wow. I mean, I'll run into a big one here in a minute. There we go. The overcast is back covering the sun. That'll help. You know, I bring what? I got probably 15, 12 rods with me. I, I use this, I use one. <laughs> one or two the, the whole day. I like to be prepared though. You never know what you're gonna run into. Oh boy. Hey now. If I can keep them on here, it's a little bit better fish. Oh yeah, it's a big spot. Nice spot. <laughs> Boy, you were hooked. <laughs> That's a two pounder. Nice one. Doesn't make up for that big large mouth I missed, but I've caught a lot of fish, so I can't complain, like I said. Boy, that fish hit it good. Still, not a single boat. I got it all to myself. Still, the, the most effective and the funnest way of catching them right now is topwater. I haven't even got to the good area yet, and I know I've got I don't know, I gotta have 12 or, or better. I'm overdue. There, I got him. He, hit a, he had to hit it twice. He missed it the first time. <laughs> hey! Pulling, pulling some drag on me. Ooh, that's a nice spot. Good fish. He got the hooks underneath the chin. Nice. <laughs> Man, is that fun. It just never gets old. Boy, he just swiped at it and missed it, came back and got it, got it on the second try. So I like to capture the, use my chest cam here to capture the blow up. And my camera's not working right. So, you know, one thing I have learned over the years is never trust the weather, man. They're, they're never right. I mean, I'm sure it could rain, did it? Right now, it sure don't look like it. There he is. I saw it, I saw it just like a shark. He came behind it big wake behind my bait boy this is the biggest fish of the day i can tell you that don't you break me off 
Oh boy, it's a giant. It's a, it's a big one. <laughs> oh man. Boy, I had him. I had him hooked too. That's that's at least three. <laughs> nice big old spot. Wow. <laughs> oh, that is fun. Oh, I can't. Jeez, that's exciting. The last. The last two fish have been my biggest fish of the day. That was a big spot. There just might be another. And there is. Oh, we hit it. Man, beautiful morning. Lots of fish. What more could you ask for? All right, thanks for watching. Um, like I said, the the summer fishing just keeps getting better. Um, stay tuned for f future episodes. I've got some good ones lined up uh, that I've already filmed. Um, but I only really I only need one rod and one lure. Uh, th that Spro Epop. Um, not all topwater baits are created equal. I'm telling you, it, it works. Take the time to learn how to use it get out there early and man you you see um, it, it 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 produces results but thanks for watching give it a thumbs up make sure you're subscribed and i will see you next time